The PowerShell version built into Windows is called Windows PowerShell. It's PowerShell version 5.1. The newer version is called PowerShell Core or simply PowerShell, and the latest stable release is PowerShell 7. To install PowerShell 7 on your computer, open a command prompt or PowerShell console and run the command. Wing it install, Microsoft.PowerShell. PowerShell 7 will be installed separately and it won't replace the older version. Instead, both versions will coexist. There are a couple of things you should know. The older version, Windows PowerShell, uses the PowerShell.exe process, while PowerShell 7 uses the PWSH process. This difference in process names allows both versions to coexist on the same computer. It also means that if you're going to run a PowerShell script, like in Task Scheduler, you need to use PWSH command if you want to use PowerShell 7. Another thing to note is that PowerShell 7 doesn't have an integrated development environment like Windows PowerShell. Instead, you'll use Visual Studio Code for scripting and development. Just make sure to install the PowerShell extension on Visual Studio Code. On a Windows version that doesn't support Winget command, like Windows Server 2019, you can download the PowerShell 7 installer from the learn.microsoft.com website. And that concludes our PowerShell 7 installation guide. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.